Hey guys, Scott here at the Gear Bunker. Today we're taking another look at a product from SOE. This is their dual tool tote. Uh, this is part of their tool line uh, that they make. Uh, they've got a few products that they're uh, making that kind of revolves around hand tools and stuff and ways to transport uh, that equipment. What I'm doing today with their new dual tote product is using it as a dop kit for when I travel. Um, you could use this thing for many different applications. It depends on uh, how creative you get. Uh, but instead of using this for tools, I'm going to use it for my travel essentials and some other extra things that I'll show you. Uh, but just to start, we'll take a quick look at the outside. Uh, this is a heavy duty Cordura fabric in the multicam black pattern, which is one of my favorites. We have an area of Velcro here where you can put a favorite patch or you can put an opposing piece of Velcro on here and actually label it uh, with what's inside if it is tools or anything like that. You also got the SOE patch uh, that's sewn on as well. The other side is just uh, blank material. The webbing for the straps actually wraps all the way around the dual tool tote. Uh, that way, if you do carry something heavy in this, the straps are going to be able to handle uh, the load in it, even if you cannot snap the snaps at the top. Um, so, at the top, since I mentioned that, the way this secures is three snaps. You got one on each end and a center snap, so that once this thing's ready to go, you just snap it up, you can throw it in a bag. You can actually carry it like this if you want. Uh, but to open it up, you're just going to undo the snaps. And it's gonna lay flat, which is kind of nice, especially for a dop kit when you're traveling. You can just kind of lay this out on in the bathroom of the hotel you're at and have all your stuff there, easy to access. Um, but to get started, we'll go ahead with this side. Uh, one design feature I wanna mention on this thing is the zippers, the way they designed it, the zippers are opposing. Uh, that way, when you do collapse the product, the zipper pulls aren't hitting each other. Just one of the small details they did to try to minimize the footprint of this thing and make it a little bit easier when you close it. Um, but on this side, I just carry the general travel essentials, toiletry type stuff, Johnny Slick's uh, pomade, Johnny Slick's beard oil, which can also double as cologne, some ibuprofen. It's always nice to have when you're away from home. Some nail clippers, deodorant, toothbrush and toothpaste and that's it for that side obviously I don't have any kind of shampoo or anything in here um, a lot of times I utilize the stuff that's at the hotels um, but if I were actually traveling um, I probably would just get the travel size stuff especially with the deodorant and toothpaste here these are full size I would be getting travel size I uh, just want to give you guys kind of an idea of what fits in there uh, these pockets are pleated so they're not, they will hold a little bit more and balloon out a little bit versus your standard flat pocket. So just remember that when you go to collapse this thing. Throw this stuff back in here real quick. And we'll take a look what I carry on the other side. All right, on this side, this is some extra stuff you may need when you're traveling. Dig into it and show you what I mean. Obviously, I've got my passport in there. Um, you don't necessarily need this domestically, but I do carry it with me all the time just for ID purposes. It's nice to have uh, passports meet a lot of the requirements for identification or other common items, even driver's license uh, don't work as well. So I carry my passport whenever I travel. Um, never know when you're going to need an old school burner phone. Got that in there and a spare SIM card. Real nice, especially if you're traveling overseas. Um, and then you always need some spare cash. So there's a bundle of two grand and 20s. You never know when you need some spare cash to get you out of a jam, get some emergency transportation, pay somebody off. Uh, cash is king in an emergency. Always have extra. And then I threw this in there. This is just the discrete stabbing tool from Violent Nomad uh, that Clint Emerson runs. Uh, it's got a tungsten tip on the end for breaking glass, and then if you unscrew the cap, you got a pen to actually write with on the other side. Uh, but it is pretty discreet. I've never had any issues with this traveling domestic or international. Uh, 
always had it in my carry-on and nobody's ever busted me for it so it stays in there but yeah discreet stabbing tool get you some extra cash when traveling in case your wallet gets stolen or you need to make a quick exit and then your passport for identification purposes and that all fits inside this dual tool tote from SOE if you're in the market for a different type of DOP kit or something to carry your travel essentials and you don't want the standard kind of toiletry bag I'd highly consider giving this guy a solid look go check him out soetactical.com it's made in the USA by USA labor thanks guys